Well, as people are getting their COVID vaccine or their booster, health experts are also encouraging people to get flu shots. Yeah, but what are the guidelines when it comes to getting these two vaccines at the same time? Jade Cunningham has a closer look. Peak flu season is right around the corner, and health experts like Dr. Fred Lopez with LSU Health Infectious Diseases says it's unknown what it'll look like. Hopefully we'll have low flu activity again this year, but it's possible that we could have a lot more activity. The number of cases reported during the last flu season is notable. According to the Centers for Disease Control from September 2020 to May 2021, more than 1,600 people in the U.S. tested positive for the flu. The season before that, the CDC estimates at least 39 million became infected. We can't predict what the flu season is going to look like. We had the lowest flu activity reported on record, uh, which started in 1997 last year, probably because of the COVID-19 interventions. The CDC also says a record number of vaccines were administered last season. With fears the flu may hit hard this go around, health experts say it is vital people get protected. But with COVID vaccines and boosters now in play, is it safe to get one of those and a flu shot at the same time? Initially, when the COVID-19 vaccines became available, out of an abundance of caution, they recommendations were to not get any vaccines two weeks before or two weeks after the COVID-19 vaccine. However, now that we've learned a little bit more about these vaccines, the CDC has come out with a recommendation that you can receive both at the same time. That goes for anyone of any age who's eligible for both vaccines. Side effects are also the same, whether or not the shots are given at the same time. So really, it's up to you on how you want to do it. I mean, if you haven't gotten one or the other yet and are eligible to do so, I highly recommend that you do that. Jay Cunningham, Eyewitness News.